The southeast is still recovering from Hurricane Helene and Milton, both of them causing billions of dollars in damage. Well, now there's concern that some of that damage could show up right here in northeast Ohio. News 5's Elizabeth Van Mietri joins us live this morning with an important warning, especially if you're in the market for a used car. Good morning, Elizabeth. Good morning. We've definitely all seen those images coming out of North Carolina, Georgia and Florida, right? We've seen those cars maybe just floating down the road or just submerged in water. Some of those cars could end up being sold to you and you may not even know it. Carfax estimates 138,000 cars were damaged within six states by Hurricane Helene. Carfax also says before the last two hurricanes that we even saw, there were 148,000 cars with flood damage already on the road. Now, as we take a closer look at these cars and where they're coming from, the different states and ownership changes, buying one of these cars could have you facing expensive repairs you didn't expect. If you're shopping for a car, make sure to have a mechanic expect it before buying it. Here's also some things to look out for. Signs of water inside like mud or carpet, musty smells, rust on bolts or mounting screws throughout the car, water lines in the headlights or milky engine oil. The Ohio State Highway Patrol works to prevent salvage vehicles from ending up on the road, including those from flood zones. They have additional steps in place to ensure flood damaged cars are properly inspected. So w when the car comes in, typically you know what has been replaced on it. So you would have receipts for doors or bumpers or hoods and, and then where you got those parts from. Uh, the inspectors will also look up maybe the car sold at an auction so they can see the previous damage that was done to the car. So they would know maybe what has been replaced or what has been repaired on the car. Now, it's important to know that selling flood damaged cars is legal, but you're going to want to look for that salvage or rebuilt title on it. Now, your best first line of defense, though, is finding a reputable car dealer before purchasing a car, especially if it's used. Back to you. Yeah, huge warning every time we see these hurricanes and flooding that there's a possibility these cars are right here in Northeast Ohio. Elizabeth, thank you.